What's going on guys, my name is Adstosh and welcome back to Undertale episode 3, I think it's 3, yeah. So in the last episode, we came to Toriel's house and then we came down here to the basement where she was trying to blow up the passage, which is where we need to go to escape. And I killed her. I don't know whether I was meant to kill her, I've got a feeling I was. So she's dead now, I can't use the phone to call her. We just have to go through this door. So, let's go. I can't believe I killed her. I've got feeling that there's a way I could have let her live, but obviously I wasn't gonna find that, was I? Kinda reminds me of the Scary Maze game there a little bit. Oh no, not you again. No, not Flowey. He he he. I hope you like your choice. After all, it's not as if you can go back and change fate. In this world, it's a kill or be killed. That old hag thought she could break the rules. She tried so hard to save you humans, but when it came down to it, he he he. She couldn't even save herself. What an idiot. Am I gonna fight him again? Nope, we just have to keep going. So, the fact that it's saying that my choices have affected things. Something tells me I didn't need to kill her. And now it's showing me the thing again. Undertale by Toby Fox. Wait, was that the intro? I'm only on episode three and I've just, just now finished the intro. Yeah, sometimes these videos should probably be a little bit longer. <laughs> Wow, that was the intro. Eek. Right, now we're in the woods. Alone. By ourselves. Notorial. What was that? I just keep walking. Bridge. Is that Sans? I think it is. Human. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. Hello. My name is Ads. <gasps> yay, it's Sans. Oh, yay. Hello. Hehe, <laughs> the old whoopee cushion in the hand trick. Yeah, I know about Sans. I, I know about Sans and Papyrus. It's always funny. Anyways, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. <laughs> I'm Sans. Sans the skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now, but, you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now, my brother, Papyrus. He's a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone. Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. Okay, I'm behind the lamp. <laughs> sup, bro? <laughs> you know what's up, brother? It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at this lamp is really cool. Don't you want to look? No, I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. Well, you're not, you're not really ready, are you? I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Then, I, the Great Papyrus, will get all the things I utterly deserve. Respect, recognition, and will finally be able to join the Royal Guard. People ask to be my friend. I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning. Hmm. Maybe this lamp will help you. Sans, you are not helping. You lazy bones. I see what you did there. All you just do around is all you do is sit around and boon a doggle. <laughs> what is boon doggle? I really want to know. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've run a ton of work done today. 
Oh, I'm, I'm making him sound like SpongeBob. I don't know why. A skeleton. back I just realized I was still recording and kind of enjoying this game up until that point. Right. <laughs> I love this game. Sans! Come on. You're smiling. I am and I hate it. Sigh. Why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get some recognition? Wow, sounds like you're really not working yourself. Down to the bone. <laughs> I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. <laughs> that was terrible. Heh. <laughs> was like Voldemort from the last Harry Potter film. Okay, you can come out now. That was amazing. <laughs> you ought to get going. He might come back. And if he does, you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. Now they're hilarious though. What's the hold up? Look, there's nothing to be afraid of. It's just a dark cavern filled with skeletons and horrible monsters. Okay. <gasps> I want to go behind here. Hello. I like this place. It's some sort of checkpoint or sentry station. But there are bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish sitting inside. Actually, hey, hate to bother you, but can you do me a favour? I was thinking, my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Even if he tries to be. Thanks a million. I'll be up ahead. I mean, you can't really be up ahead when you're older or whatever. Right, we've got another save point here. The convenience of that lamp still fills you with determination. Right, here we go. Which way to go? This is a box. You can put an item inside or take an item out. The same box will appear later, so don't worry about coming back. Sincerely, a box lover. Right. We've got another fight who we'll be fighting. Snowdrake flutters forth. We gotta go kill him. What? Oh, that was awful. Awful by me. Ooh. Better not snowflake out. Oh, jeez. What is this? Easy to avoid though. He's still smiling at his own joke. A bit like um, Sans, isn't he? Oh, so annoying. Macaroni and freeze. Well, mm. Snowdrake is flaking apart. That's why I'm gonna kill him. You won 26, 22 experience. That's a lot more than what I got before. <gasps> Fishing. I wanna play in the sea, river, whatever. It's a fishing rod affixed to the ground. Reel it in. Uh -huh. My voice just left me there. Yeah. All that's attached to it is a, is a photo of a weird looking monster. Call me, here's my number. You decide not to call. What? Actually, I could have been tutorial. For all we know. Right. So we went the wrong way. Let's go this way. So, as I was saying about Undyne. Sounds, oh my god, is that a human? Uh, actually, I think that's a rock. Oh, hey, what's in that in front of the rock? Oh my god, is that a human? Yes. Oh my god, Sans, I finally did it. Undyne will, I'm gonna, I'll be so popular, popular. Ahem, human, you shall not pass this area. I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you. I will then capture you. You'll be delivered to the capital. Then, then, I'm not sure what's next. In any case, continue, only if you dare. <laughs> well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye on, I'll keep an eye socket out for you. Whatever. Right, let's move on. We've got another one of these house things. What is it? 
there's some narration on this cardboard box. You observed the well-crafted sentry station. Who could have built this, you ponder? I bet it was that very famous royal guardsman. Note, not yet a famous royal guardsman. So it has been virus wrote that. Don't know what. Ice cap struts into view. Oh, jeez. I mean, I knew, see, I could have one-shot it if I got right in the middle. And what is this? Oh, so it's just a really easy... I was a way to say a really, <laughs> a really easy um, move to avoid, but I almost got hit by it. Boom, ice crap, crap, cap, 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 ice cap. I got hit? Oh, seems like I did. My love increased. Right, here we go. Read a sign. Absolutely no moving. Sorry about that. That is not terrifying at all. <laughs> Did something move? Was it my imagination? No, it's a massive dog behind you. I can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure it never moves again. Doggo blocks the way. <laughs> no, not doggo. Don't move an inch. Oh, jeez. Moving, moving, moving. Doggo is confirming the moving object. Dead. You won. You went 30 XP and 30 gold. Well, that was interesting. Someone's been smoking dog treats. <laughs> okay. Yay. Sans. Hey, here's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move and it won't hurt you. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so imagine a blue stop sign instead. Simple, right? Well, when fighting, think about blue stop signs. You say it in yellow, that does not confuse me. Whoa! Right, we're gonna try and get to this sign. Pua. North, ice. South, ice. West, ice. East, snow them down. Never eat shredded wheat. Okay, right. And ice. So we're going this way. You are so lazy. You will napping all night. Well, it kind of meant to. It's kind of what night is. I think that's actually called sleeping. See? Excuses, excuses. Hello. Oh, ho. The human arrives. In order to stop you, my brother will have created some puzzles. I, th I think you'll find this one quite shocking. For you see, this is the invisible electricity maze. When you touch the walls of this maze, the orb will administer a, a hearty zap. Sound like fun? Because the amount of fun you'll probably have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, you can go ahead now. Sand, what did you do? I think the human has to hold the orb. Oh, okay. <laughs> Hold this, please. I wonder where I'm meant to go. Okay, try now. Darn. Incredible! You slippery snail! <laughs> you solved it so easily! Too easily! However, this next puzzle will not be easy. It is designed by my brother, Sans. You will surely be confounded. I know I am. <laughs> right, come here. Hey, thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he's wearing? We made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. Keep calling it his battle body. Man, isn't my brother cool? <laughs> no, he's, he's, yeah, yeah. What the hell are you? You're like a reverse Squidward. I don't understand why these things aren't selling. It's the perfect weather for something cold. Oh, a customer. Hello, would you like some nice cream? Yeah. It's the frozen treat that warms your heart. Oh, that's nice. Just one 15G. Yeah, let's buy one. Here you go. Have a super duper day. You got the nice cream. Yay, look how happy he is. Right, we got a ball. This is gonna be fun. Go, go, no, come back. Oh, sounds here. 
Hello. I've been thinking about selling treats too. Want some fried snow? She said 5G. Yeah, that's fine. Did I say 5G? I meant 50. Yeah, we'll still buy. Really? How about 5,000? Yeah. 5,000, 50,000 G, that's my final offer. Yes. What? You don't have the money? Hey, that's okay. I don't have any snow. Oh, I didn't mean to. Ooh. Smell danger rating. Snow smell, snowmen. White rating could become yellow rating. Unsuspicious smell, puppy blue rating. Smell of rolling around. Weird smell, humans, green rating. Destroy at all costs. Isn't that fantastic? Right, let's go play with the snowball. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I feel a bit like... I feel a bit like Lionel Messi at this rate. Oh yeah. No. No, it's going. Quick. 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 Oh no. Quick. No, come back. This is so annoying. No, don't shrink. Uh, uh, no, come back. No. Oh my god. Right, go. No. 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 No, it's us. Okay, we got a new one, right. We move. 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 No. Stop. Stop. Right, here we go. It's not actually that hard. It's just that I'm, the way I'm doing it is making it quite difficult. Here we go. Alright, there's a hole down here to fit it into. So we're playing like a really... We're playing foot golf then. Oh, yes! Did you see that shot? Tiger Woods eat... Actually, he's rubbish now. That's it. Nah. What does this say, Tiger Woods eat your heart out? Right, so we did it. And I'm slipping and sliding. Alright, let's go. <gasps> Another one. Oh, this is a mini golf course. It looks like a snowball. Actually... It's a snow, snow decadron. Oh yeah, so it is. I didn't even notice. Oh, come on. I want to play another one. That would be fun. Right, let's go. Oh, we're back. Human, I hope you're ready for. <laughs> Sans, where's the puzzle? It's right there, on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can get past this one. Monster Kids Word Search. I see. Hey, kids. Can you help me solve this puzzle? I'm sure I can. Um. Um. I found a skeleton. Skeletons. How do I do it? I'm not quite sure how I'm meant to do this word search. So I really want to do it. I go up and talk to him. Sand, that didn't do anything. Whoops. I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that. In my opinion, Junior Jumble is easily the hardest. What? Really? Dude? That's an easy peasy word scramble? That's her baby bones. Um, believable. Human, solve this dispute. Which is harder? Jumble or crossword? Crossword. You two are weird! Crosswords are so easy! It's the same solution every time, it's really not. I just fill in the boxes with the letter Z, because every time I look at the crosswords, all I can do is snore. Yeah. <laughs> Thank god he's gone. Papyrus finds difficulty in interesting places. Yesterday, he got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. <laughs> oh my god. Right. We got a save point here. Knowing the mouse might one day find a way to heat up the spaghetti fills you with determination. And it fills me with time. Oh no. Pretty much we're gonna be ending the episode here. So we got introduced to Sans and Papyrus finally, and that makes me extremely happy. So if <laughs> we are extremely happy to see this series still going, please do leave a massive thumbs up on the video. Comment any other games you want to see me play. Or comment any secrets about the game that you might want me to know about for next time. Subscribe if you're new as well. Turn on notifications so you never miss a video that I make. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.